curly. Ugh. Fuck you! Of my invisible line. Ah. Sweet baby Jesus and the orphans. Let's see what we got. Morning. I feel considerably better today. I feel like nearly 100%, which is great because it's a Monday, fresh week. I feel really dizzy though, and I don't know why. Like, even sat here, I just feel a bit, woo. No change there, eh? Dizzy bitch. No, seriously, I do feel dizzy. Anyway, I'm just going to take it easy. I'm going to edit in bed with my Vimto. And we'll see where the day takes us. Log 71, ready to go. Oh no, look, this little baby's stuck in my room. I'll help you. He found his way out himself. They're not stupid like flies, are they? Butterflies just know what's going on. Oh my goodness. Archibald's batteries have come. Uh, do we actually see this right now? This is riveting content. Riveting. Archibald is about to come back to life. Archibald, sorry. Come on, get in. This is very tense. I don't want to get my hopes up because what if he's just too old to work? I literally bought all these batteries to bring him back to life. And he snaked me like that. Saving! All up to date, praise the Lord. I just need to... Fuck, I've got to edit, edit my hair vlog actually. I've got a secret vlog as well. Secret one coming up. I washed my hair for the first time. Which felt a bit naughty really, washing it after just two days. But I have been laying in bed for two days straight. Like being sweaty and smelly and ill. So, kind of needed it. And he said that it'll fluff up once you wash it once, which I don't understand the science in that. Like, why would that happen? I don't know, but that's what he said. So, I've washed it because I'm going to film all the end of the TikToks and the end of the hair vlog tomorrow. So, I want it to look nice anyway. Yeah. And the colour kind of needed even it out because... The extensions, obviously, because it's different hair to my hair, goes a different colour with the dye. So they were ever so slightly darker than my hair, so I'm hoping to get evened it out, maybe. Look at the way this shit is drying. <laughs> my hair is so bushy at the top, and then... I mean, it's not bad, but... <laughs> look, at, look at the side. Hang on. Oh, you get the gist. I just need to curl it, but... I'm saving it for tomorrow. I think the colour's a bit more evened out, though. Sav... <laughs> I told Sam I'm sad and she's coming round. She's just so cute. She just literally texted me and said, sleep over. I was like, yeah. I'm not telling you why I'm sad because it's... Uh, I suppose I can't say, but... It's annoying because I always... I'm an open book. I'm... They would tell the world my problems. But I can't always. Yeah, so I'm trying to tidy my room because I don't want her to think I'm a scruff. <laughs> I'm a scruff. She literally knows I'm a scruff anyway, so what am I doing? No, I just don't want to stay in my pigsty room because I've been like brewing in it for the past two days. Oh, she's trying to make me try this. It's nice. No. She's treating me to a fake tango ice bath. No, it does taste like a tango ice does bath. Does it? Whoa, I love a slushy. It doesn't taste like an ice bath, but it's nice. It tastes like a slush puppy. It is a slush puppy. What? They've conned us. They've conned you. Oh, I just wanted a cute bit of us in bed and she's on the light too bright. Now it's unnatural. Wow, oh, what wanna do? Just doesn't matter. Just leave me alone. Morning, morning, morning. I stuck with my hair in a one plait at the back. But obviously all my hair's come out at the front anyway. And just kind of left it like that. But I think it's kind of cute. It's like a really scruffy side plait. I hope you can't see my Hello Kitty images. Um, no, you can. I hope you can. Yeah, so I need to. I started planning Halloween this morning, which is depressing. Um, God, I'm going to really need to get it out of the way. Maybe like do 15 looks in September. Sorry, cross the eyes. Why do I look so patchy? Is that just a light? If she looks in September 15th and October, can I do it? I don't know. That's still one every other day though. It sounds easy, but it's not. 
out. Yeah, I need to do my hair videos today and then I'll just take it from there. Morning, Mr. Giraffe. Oh, it's our channel's birthday. Happy birthday, channel. Setting off an Emily wax melt to get the party started. Pink dragon fruit. Basically, I'm just stalling. So, he said it would fluff out after one wash. Which, you know, I don't understand the signs of whatever. Anyway, and obviously I had it cut dead thin and spindly. Just because I like the look of that. But look how much it like looks so thick and fluffy now that it's been washed. Jesus, I hope I can recreate what he did. Is it going to be okay? Oh, it doesn't look the same as when you did it. It looked cooler when you did it. Oh no. It's going to be ruined for the video. Fucking hell, they just came right out. Probably should have had her sprayed. Ugh. These are not the curls I'm after. No. Okay, that's, that's a bit better. Yeah? It's just a bit curly, Sue. Looks a bit... I don't know. It's very different on there than it does on there. Anyway, the colours are much more like matchable now and I really like it. I just straightened out the ends of the curls and I think that's made it less curly so I just it needs wearing in. I like it more flat and you know. I wanna be as a lovey. I want it to be messy and to be fair, she's had it really nice and curly sometimes. You know what I mean though? I want it scruffy, scruffy, messy, curly. Ugh! I'm sorry, can we just take a moment for this? Motel Rocks outfit. I love it. I literally love anything with sleeves. Any sort of top like this. I had this long sleeve top like this I used to absolutely rim in um, school. From Topshop, I lost it and it really pissed me off because I would still wear it to this day. You know you love it if you wear a top for 10 years straight. And then this mini skirt which is incre like, incredibly short. <laughs> So, I mean, I think it's supposed to be low rise, but I'm not wearing it like that. Can you imagine? I've just got cream on my questionable belly button piercing right now. But yeah, I think this is just a good outfit. It's a good outfit. But it's this time I go. In fact, I want someone to ask me to go out right now so I can wear it. I'm sorry, with the boots. I feel like I'm on Monster High. Everyone bums off that. Uh, yeah. Someone invite me out. Right, I filmed my YouTube. Uh, so that's out of the way. It's half edited. Uh, I, I really wanted to get the end videos to my hair videos. But the lighting's just not doing it. Some days just nothing works. I really don't understand the science of it. Maybe I just look like dog rough today, I don't know. But nothing's working, which is annoying because I wanted to finish the video, so I'm like, what do I do now? Why is this bit gone all 70s on me? Snake. I posted my hair video. Hooray. This is out into the world. I managed to get a little bit of good lighting in the end, but I didn't finish all my videos. Anyway, I've got this jaded order here. The, uh, the pixel top came back in stock. Now I have the boobs where I need I need a compressed t-shirt to make them look good, you know, hold them in place because otherwise they're just pointy and like um, So we ordered this pixel top, it's fucking sick. And it was just that loose material, you know, where it does nothing for you. But I had to get size medium because the other ones were out of stock, so I've got an extra small now because it's just been really stock. So I'm really, really hoping, praying, that this is nice. I really don't think it will be because the material's so soft, but we'll see. Gabri, this is so FHM. It will do. Yeah, I think it it works. It's not exactly. <laughs> I do that because Lucy, she just fucking rolls her eyes all the time. Yeah, it's not completely squished, but it's not completely far out. It'll do. And then I also got. This little velvet number, which I saw, I literally saw a girl wearing this a year ago. I remember thinking, what a fucking sick outfit, but she had matching pants as well. But the top was in a sale and I was like, damn, can I do it? You gotta be, 
I feel like you've got to be pretty skinny to pull this off. I mean, for me personally, I know some people would look amazing in it, but wow, that is a very skimpy top. I'll try it. Wow, I really don't know if I've got this on correct Amondo, but... I got it in a six as well, so it's very fucking tight, hence the um, otherwise non-existent cleavage. Uh, I think I'll keep it though. Yeah? I think it's cool. Will I ever wear it? Probably not, but I'd like to know that it's in my wardrobe. Just for safekeeping. And it's in the sale as well, so I'd be silly to send it back, even if I'm not going to wear it. Finished the hair vlog and it's bang on 25 minutes. Nice and satisfying. The bedside drawer of a psychopath. Good morning. I really need to get a... What are those things called? A rooty. I really need to get a rooty. What the fuck is that? I've got old mascara there. Ooh, mascara goop. Ooh. It's literally 20 to 11. I need to start going up at least like nine, half eight. Let's see if I can do that tomorrow. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the first supreme parcel of the fall winter collection. Yeah. Let's go. Is it waterproof? A pullover. I think it's cool. I think it's evil. I need some black Adnola leggings to go with it though, because that is oh oh it's a, it's a funny texture. I hope I can pull it in at the bottom. Wow, she is hardcore. I like it. I think it looks relatively evil. Yeah, that some leggings. I love looking like a little muffin on top with little pigeon's legs. <laughs> oh, that looks like a sack at the moment. What stickers did I get? Please be the gold one, please be the gold one. Fuck you! Fucking hell. I mean, to be fair, the Catwoman one is cool as fuck. I actually wanted that t shirt, but I don't think I do t shirts. Well, as in, like, for an outfit. Ah! Boring fucking Supreme one. Catwoman. And then this bag of pile of rubbish by the Statue of Liberty with a. Supreme bag on there. It's quite cool actually. I like that. But I wanted the old gold one. They have an old gold foil one and it's like debossed. Embossed, debossed. Yeah. Just had another visit from another friend because all my friends are taking pity on me. Because <laughs> I'm sad. I can't be honest. I've just got no motivation to do anything. I do not eat pot noodles, right? I don't eat pot noodles. I'm not a pot noodle girl. I just think they taste rank. But you know I'm a complete whore. For time, I just found this Thai green curry one, so I'm gonna try it because I'm fucking well hungry and starving. We're having a barbecue later, and I was thinking, I'm just gonna have a smoothie and just like fly through to tea time. Look at that fake time, <gasps> fly through to tea, tea time without eating anything. But as it turns out, I can't do it. No, not worth the calories. No, don't like it. No. Nah. No, I just do not like pot noodles, no. It's either a naked noodle or a super noodle. Not a pot noodle. Lord, no. Can't finish that. I'd, I'd made a good effort, but no, no. Oh, look. Oh. It's giant. <laughs> a boring day. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to start out a clipping fringe. I don't know if I already have one ready, but I love a clipping fringe. Oh. Clipping fringe with long curly hair. I feel like it looked a bit like wig esque with the um, short hair. So I'm gonna gonna get a fringe prepared. Yeah. It's a dessert. That is a dessert. Can you hear them dogs going mad at each other? <laughs> right, I'm gonna have to have a bath now because someone got excited with the light of liquid. And now my hair stinks, which I didn't want to wash it again. That's two times in like two days. But my hair stinks of smoke, light of fluid, etc. 
there's no choice. We have no choice. But it's okay because I need to scrub off this horrendous tan. Look at my hair in it. Oh my god. <laughs> that's bad, that's bad. I forgot about the fucking the fringes. Anyway. I found two. I'm gonna use this scraggly one. I know it looks like a bunch of pubes, but it makes more sense. And I'm gonna save this blonde one for when I have it blonde. Yeah? Yeah? Ten past eight, she's done it. Got all white and all in there as well. <laughs> Alright, let's see how the fringe is doing. Wow, do you know what? I've not been in my car for nearly two weeks. That's madness. I've missed you! I love that because then it's like fun driving again. I mean, it's always fun, but you know what I mean. Funner. This ponytail is a snake. Look at... It's just out to get me. All my normal hair's there. Oh. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. It's just the gym. Oh, yes. I have a dentist appointment today also. So hopefully we can get the Invisalign going soon. Because, I mean... I'm just thinking about it dragging into next year now. Well, of course it's gonna. What, what are we in? September. September was all another in December. So even if I started it now and say I only needed it six months, we're in there. We're into the old 2023. I've failed myself. No, that no. Everyone else has failed me. <laughs> that those pink flowers would probably match your outfit as well. I was in the fucking right hand lane, right? And there's this guy in front of me. There was no one in front of him. It was just me and he was in front of me. And he was fucking going absolutely pussy miles an hour, right? And everyone's going round me, going in front of him. And I, I just thought, I'm not having this. I look a dick here. So I flash him and he gets out of the way. And then just as I go past, I thought, I'll have a nosy see like, who is this guy? Why is he taking so fucking long? And he just had his hand like that whilst he was driving. I just thought, what is, what is your beef? Just don't go in the right lane if you're going to drive like my mum. I don't know who you're angry at. I'm angry at you. Anyway, other than that, it was a lovely dentist trip. Everyone was very nice. They had nice spa music on. Made me feel very at ease. Even though I wasn't getting anything terrible done. Um, But yeah, I'm going to have my Invisalign. I get it in four weeks ish so praise the lord i'm gonna try and use up all my teeth whitening stuff i got from my last dentist um visit you know ages ago uh because that is to the mold of my teeth so obviously when i start getting invisalign it won't fit in my mouth anymore so yeah it fucking hurts so i did it last night and my teeth are like now ah Got some parcels, got the whole list from Boots. It's for a job. They've sent stuff in bulk, which I've not even read the brief, but I don't see why they would need to send them in bulk. Maybe this is to do with the brief, I don't know. Don't know, but if anyone wants mascara, I'm your girl. Uh, and then got some dyes from Hayley Williams brand. Good dye young. Nice, can't wait to try those. And then, oh yeah, I got this little Hello Kitty bag from AliExpress. I knew it would be shit, right? I just got it anyway. And it is shit, but I kind of rate it. It's nice and simple. I'm going to repaint the nose though, because it's a fucking mess. Sad, once again, always. I've done my tan anyway and curled my hair, so I feel a bit um better. I feel like a princess. Me and Henry are going to watch Robin Hood on FaceTime together now. Oh. Wow, my buns hurt today. Buns of steel. Wow. Oh, it really hurts. I really hope this is nice. I've run out of my berry mix, so I just used the fruit from the other smoothie mixes. I like mango and shit. Which I don't mind, but I just like all berries in berry smoothies. Very pineapple-y. Um, it's alright. I'm that old, I'm that boring that I've asked for for Christmas this year. Of the whole family, I would like a fruit ninja because I'm sick of my moochibullet. Mo moochibullet not being able to blend this shit. Does anyone have frozen smoothies every morning? Because it just can't handle the frozen fruit. Mum's like, I don't use fresh fruit. Because if you use fresh fruit, it's warm and it tastes like sick. 
and also you've obviously got to eat fresh fruit asap like if you don't eat it within a week you're done whereas you can keep frozen fruit in the freezer for ages and it's nice and cold so i'm hoping that a fruit ninja is really good for frozen fruit it's it's rated the best for frozen fruit so i'm hoping hoping it's not a con i just want to turn it on and it does it and it's like 10 seconds or whatever and then i can have my drink whereas with that fucking Nutribullet, I turn it on and I have to keep shaking it to like move the stuff around because it can't handle it. And then it overheats and it goes Wee! and it splatters everywhere and it's just... <sighs> I'm not even a girl that screams at spiders but I just scream at this. Wow, actually wow. Right, I ordered from Bershka. Um, I got these Karomi socks. And then I only like went to actually wear them maybe like three weeks after I bought them. And I saw they've left the fucking thing on them through an online order. But you know, I was prepared to make my peace with it. I thought, you know, I can just go to the Bershka store with my email. But then I think the nearest Bershka store is like Liverpool or something. And then, you know, yeah, yeah I was prepared to make my peace with it. I go to put my cargoes on today. What the fuck is that? Piss me off. Right, I have absolutely no motivation to do anything else. So, I'm working with Primark, um, but for some reason they're not sending the clothes out, which is right palaver. So they sent me um, a Primark voucher, so I have to go in the store <sighs> to go and get it. <sighs> big blag, big blag, I cannot be asked. I'm getting it out of the way, because I know... Oh, she's parked behind me again, I cannot. Um... Primark near me just won't have it, anything. So I'm having to go to the big Primark, which is further away. Ugh, let's just get it out of the way. Also, apparently if I use two forks on this, it's like a TikTok thing, I can get it off. So if I get ink all over my favorite pants, I don't know whether there's ink in that or what, but that's what I've heard. <sighs> oh, I don't know how this is gonna work, actually. Mm, it's gonna end in tears, though. Oh no. Oh no. I need to remember to get um... No, I don't think it's... How the hell is it attached? Just in the middle of the toilet, uh, Mr. Postman knocks on the door, so I have to fucking pump the pants up and run off. My Seamwire parcel has come. I thought it was something from AliExpress. It's so poor and packaged. Look how they've come. Unbelievable. Wrapped in... Lips, lips are wrapped in fucking whatever it's called, bubble wrap like that. That is fucking poor. They're like £50 each. Oh, wait. Yeah, I think they're £40 each. That's ridiculous. I'm pretty sure Kim K wears these as well. Mm, I'm pretty, pretty sure. Could be, mm, probably wrong there. Probably wrong. Mm, whatever. Been waiting a while for these. I feel like I'm going to look like Ali Jean then. It could all go downhill. But the reason I got them was this. I really wanted these for ages. I keep seeing everyone wearing them. They're sick. But they have like a buy one get one free offer on so I thought. Might as well buy them now. So that's why I got the LED ones as well. Well. Yeah, they're cool. They're a little bit big. I thought they would be. They look a bit big on everyone, but I suppose that's just the look. Um, yeah, cool. I'll wear them today. Should we try on the LED ones? Oh, do I even bother? My God. West side is the best. Take those off now. I need to delete this YouTube immediately. Yeah, they're just, mm, I might sell them. I was gonna get a basket, but look at the fucking stay in that. Looks moth eating. This is gonna be hell. I've got like a sheet that I have to pick from two lines for this video. But I've got to find the fucking stuff first. And it's not organized. Oh my God. Oh, it never ends. I absolutely love this. And it says it's made from recycled materials, but it looks so stupid on my arm. It's too thick. Guys, mission complete. I am moderately embarrassed at this point. Mate, that was fucking traumatic. Oh, I'm so glad I got it out of the way. Oh, I ended up spending £93 over the £100 voucher. Good Lord Jesus tonight. 
I was looking for, I had two sections to look for. So basically there's like a trend. Oh, I up my car, are you old man? It is very nice, isn't it? Thank you very much. There's all these like trending sections and I'm doing a video for two of these trends. But I had to find the section that had the stuff that I belong, that I needed and it was all just lay out everywhere. And I was like, oh! I kept asking, I was like, excuse me, do you know where this is? And they'd say a different thing, like a different direction every time. It was just awful. In the end, I managed it. I ended up obviously picking up a load of random shit that I don't need. I just get really excited in Primark. Like, all the basics you need, all the Disney stuff you didn't know you needed, that you need. Yeah, bit OTT. Cute lingerie. I'll show you when I get home. Babies crying everywhere. I, I was in there. I'm not joking. I was in there for 2 hours, 15 minutes. And I had to buy one of these fucking, what is it, polyester? I had to buy one of these polyester bags because they would have just ripped the other one and that would have... Made using recycled plastic. Is that right? Where have I got polyester from? I don't know what it's made out of a look. But I had to get it because imagine me carrying two of them big paper ones and it, they just break. Oh. Take me home. Take me home. Sweet baby Jesus and the orphans. Let's see what we got. So this was part of the job. We got this little jumper. And I thought this would be super, super cute with, ah! with this skirt. Yeah, jumper skirt, that's cute. That's outfit number one. Hi Carter, I didn't know you was in here. Outfit number two is this little denim thing, you know, jacket. I'm gonna cut the bottom off it actually when I'm done with the video. And then matching trousers, these straight leg jeans. They're like little ripped material, which I think is quite nice. Yeah, that's outfit number two. And outfit number three, I just got this neon knitted little vest and I'm gonna wear a big white shirt underneath it. So it'll be like a little dress. Uh, and then with that, I will be wearing these pattern tights because I've been looking for these on ASOS for so long. They're always out of stock. Well, obviously not since summer, I haven't, but um, in winter I was looking on for, for them for ages. Always out of stock. And they were like £10 and obviously from Primark they were much, much cheaper. So, yeah. I got these Wayne the Bee pyjamas. Ah. I don't even fucking wear pyjamas, so I hate myself for this, but they were just so cute. These little fluffy bottoms, and then they don't be dumb. And then I, I even got, as if that wasn't enough, I can't fucking find it. Uh, this jumper, I don't actually know what this is for, it's still for the job. It's not something I've bought off my own back, but uh, I can't remember where, what it's supposed to go with. But these fucking Care Bear socks, how cute. These, and then a little nighttime one. Oh, sunshine one. Ooh. Really cute. Uh, my prescription. And then after that, that was a colour pop brief. That was a pop of colour brief, and then this one is a more chilled one. So I got this little skirt. Fucking hell, how's it go? This little tartan skirt, which is going to go with this little and th no this isn't pink because it's not to be posted on my page so it's fine this little cute dallas saloon top and then these cargo pants which i raided the entire fucking store for they've got a nice contrast stitch fuck the bags all in with this little green leafy top then i'll wear them cargos again with this little brown mushroom top and then the shirt to match, so it's all very beige, that collection thing. Got my dad some socks for the gym. I got my mum this Sweetie Pie sleeping mask because she works nights, so that's cute. She loves Sweetie Pie. Hopefully she likes it. And then this is the other pyjama top I got. It goes with the shorts. So, you know, if you're feeling like a long sleeve one, if that material's too sweaty wear that one with it anyway and then last but not least i literally just found this hung up in the middle of nowhere this little lingerie set 
which I don't even wear brows, but I've started to wear them recently because I want to feel like a girl. I want to feel like a princess. Um, I said I've started wearing them. I've worn them. I've worn one last week. That was it. Yeah, I just thought they were really nice. These little tie things instead of strap. Well, you know what I mean. You know what I mean. So that was nice. And it was so fucking nice. I got it in both colours. And that is the end of my Primark haul. Good morning! Uh, it's really not good when you hide a birthday present and then you can't find it. I don't know where I put it. And I need it now. And I literally have turned the room upside down. An hour later, found it. All they said it was underneath all the clothes. Fuck. The time has come to sell. Daddy's gonna put my curtain up, isn't he? You're gonna sort out that curtain that you've messed up. Isn't that right? Yeah. Long, long underdue. Long overdue. Long underdue. Right, we've done a lot. We've done a lot. Well done, Jenna. I think I've got 50 items on my vintage now. People are so cheeky, though. Like, I'm putting this shit on. It's Most of it is brand new with tags. And it's like literally more than half price most of it. I could go online, most of that nasty girl stuff, right? Some that blazer I put on, I think it was like 89 online and I put it on for like 15 pounds. Someone's like, making me a lower offer. Come on, you snake. Just <coughs> come on, I'm already giving you all I can. Just fucking do me a favor and buy it here. Alright. <clears throat> I'm storing it all in my boot so I don't have to look at it in my room anymore because I can't bear it. So if this car gets burnt down, then I'll actually be quite glad actually. Right, I'm getting ready now. We've got a family birthday meal. And then I'm going out. I get to wear my little black outfit that I've not worn yet, so that's great. I hate when you have a nice outfit and you just have no fucking place to wear it. Phone keys, wallet. We're done. We're ready. There was a great debate between these and these, but everyone voted these, so let's go. Excuse me! Oh, don't be tired. Look out for the goddamn blow. Never wants me in my mouth. Less of the blow. Ten to four. I actually feel like maybe like eighteen again. Ten to four. Ten to four, eh? Oh God, I feel like my youth's crawling back to me. I'm so ridiculously tired. Go to the fucking donkey sanctuary. <laughs> I feel like a donkey. Okay. Here we go. Yeah, the mothership. Yeah. Praise the Lord for being back in bed. Four hours sleep. Oh, I need my bed. The donkey sanctuary was not completely as expected. Um, I thought we'd get to touch them a bit more than that. I thought it would be a bit bigger, actually. Yeah, it was alright. My mum loved it. That's what I'll do. I was a bit bored, not gonna lie, but I'm back. I've got a meal deal. 
Oh my god, could it be? Could it be? Oh, you knocked on! Come in, come in! Don't ask why there's socks there, I don't know, they're not mine. Hello! Only for you. Go on then. Come on! Billy no teeth, huh? I fell asleep for five hours. Six o'clock. I fell asleep for that many hours that my tans developed. Just going to Jakey's now. Um, I feel really ill now after that little bout of food poisoning all the time. I think it's still affecting me. I'm sick all the time. I kind of like it though. I hope I lose weight from it. Such an unhealthy thought, I know. Look at the mask. So much mask.